GTA Online, where this week, it's finally here. I have been waiting months for this car. This is the Audi R8, which, yes, has been available. I hate Kimmy. Jeez it. The Audi R8's been in the game for a little while. However, I refused to buy it when it originally came to the game. I was waiting for the car to come to Benny, where you can wide body the thing. It's got an insane amount of customization. I don't actually know if it's possible to do the time trial. We're gonna try, and we're gonna take it online and do some races. Let's buy this thing, bright yellow, 1.7 mil. No, those are in the luxury car dealer. Both both of the open wheel race cars. That is awesome. Are they still stupid expensive? Yup. Let's set up the agency and then go to Benny. Where did my car go? Kimmy! Kimmy! Look at these two things next to each other. Our BMW Mercedes next to our Audi R8. Bro, that's so cool. Is this like a V10 Audi R8? Let's, let's see. Wait, so we've got one, two, three, four, Five. So it is. It is a V10 Audi R8. That's awesome. Oh, drag button. This thing has active aero. No way. Look at my rear wing. Kimmy! Right out of the gate, I'm immediately wondering, do you think we're gonna be able to turn this thing into like an Audi R8 LMS car? I don't really know, but we've got to start it off with the half a million dollar wide body. Yo, that's so cool. I love how it's like, it's like a Liberty Walk. Audi R8, actually. Let's jump into this thing. So armor, no. Just for the simple fact that it annoys the YouTube comments. Brakes, we'll upgrade that very nicely. Bumpers, we have 19. Okay, they actually might be front splitters. So carbon fiber, a little yellow trim down on the bottom. Forged carbon fiber, that is so sick. Are we gonna be able to mess around with the actual front bumper? That's really cool. Very nice race car. Again, with the forged carbon fiber. I feel like I'm gonna try to keep this thing fairly clean though. I'm gonna go for this one. 13,000 bucks on a front bumper. Rear diffuser, 21 different options. I know it was a thing on the regular version of the Audi R8, but you could delete the rear bumper. Take a look at our diffuser. So forged carbon fiber little diffuser. That's really cool, actually. Again, forged carbon fiber. Exposed with a carbon fiber diffuser. Oh, I know it's not exactly clean, but that's insane. No rear bumper because why not? 18 different canard options. Wow, okay, so this, so this actually messes around with the grill as well. Those are actually not bad. Very aggressive looking. Again, very aggressive looking. You know what? Those actually kind of fit. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna go for those 17 grand for those. Engine will upgrade all the way up to level four. Our exhaust, 23 options. So again, I'll rev it up and we'll scroll through all of these. So stock exhaust, titanium tips, aluminum carbon fiber tip. Hey, the way those connect is actually really, really nice. We have a twin turbo wide body Audi R8. Look at the air filters on there. Blast pipes. That's incredible. That is so insane. I think I'm gonna go for these. The titanium exhaust twin turbo. 18k for an exhaust. I feel like we've already spent like three mil on this. Okay, and then we can mess around with our front grill. We can remove the grill. Toss on a radiator in the front. Oh, man, do I want that, though? It looks really cool, but I don't think it fit. All of Twitch chat says no. Hoods. Okay, so hood catches. I think I probably will go for some hood latches. They're just kind of cool. We'll go for some black ones. And the hood itself, 20 different options, and it actually spills over to the wide body. I really like that one. That's really, really nice. Again, really nice. Okay. Okay. I think we've got some really good options for this. I feel like this is actually probably the best one. It also kind of reminds me of like the R8 race cars you sometimes see. Horn will pass on that. Our interior. So we've got a full customizable interior on this thing. The seats you can change. The steering wheel you can change. That's not even remotely close to being lined up. I'm not gonna mess with any of that though. Our headlights, I'm gonna pass on that. Neons, I'm gonna pass on that. Our livery, we'll come back to that in a second. Our wing mirrors, okay. Got a bunch of different options here. So primary ones, carbon fiber ones. That's probably gonna be the play. Actually, no, forged carbon fiber. Cameras, wait, does that actually... Oh, I thought that would put little screens on the inside. That would have been too cool. Forged carbon fiber. 
Definitely. Our license plate. Oh, roof fins. Okay. So I think we probably will want a little bit of a roof fin on there. But before we do, I think I want to make our roof black. Like that one though. Yes, probably forged carbon fiber again. Forged carbon fiber is just cool. That's a really nice forged carbon fiber one. Let's go for that. Very nice forged carbon fiber. I don't think I do want a roof fin. I think I'm just going to keep the roof clean. Side panel. Oh, I'm just saying if you could remove that little yellow bit in there, it'd be full on an Audi R8. Just saying. Again, just spicy. Side skirts. Okay, we've got 17. Okay, they're all kind of the same. I think I'm just going to go for a little bit of a subtle one. Kind of like that. 30 different rear wings. Carbon fiber spoiler. Forged carbon fiber. Nice little ducktail forged carbon fiber. All of the little stuff. That's like off a Lamborghini Huracan. That's really nice, actually. Ooh, I think today might be the day where we actually run a ducktail. Those are actually really nice. That's kind of like an R8 GT car. Okay, that's actually from the Audi R8 V10 Plus. Uh, that's like two race car, two race car... He says as he runs no rear bumper, that's just dumb. Look at that. So cool looking. It's so sick. I love ducktails. I'm not actually a fan of big rear wings, he says as he drives a Subaru. So let's also go for a, a, a sun strip on there, sure. Suspension will slam it all the way to the ground, make it look a little cooler. Transmission, upgrade that. Our turbo, upgrade that. And finally, our windows. Wow. Stage two of our upgrades. Let's come to our livery. Let's see... What we've got, racing stripes definitely do not work. The German flag isn't bad. That's also not bad, but it just doesn't fit the car. It's got to fit the car. That's pretty nice, but again, it doesn't fit. It's like someone just put stickers on. Hey, Wolfs has his own livery. We're just going to go with a base color. Okay, Twitch chat, what color should this thing be? Just so we know, our secondary color will be our trim down on the bottom. Okay. I've always been a fan of white Audi R8s, if I'm honest. Ooh, oh, Twitch chat says, what about Nardo gray? What about a matte light gray? Oh my God, that's pretty cool. What if I... I go matte gray and then gold rims. That is such a sick looking car. No joke. I think that's one of the nicest looking cars we've ever made. Oh my God. We have a lot of Audi R8s. Hi boys. Fire. Fire of course had to go with a bright pink Audi R8. Again, wide body, tons of forged carbon fiber. Very nice. Baron had to go for Baron purple. Always a nice play. And he's gone for the tofu paint job. Jack, we literally copied each other, bro. Jack went for more of like an Audi R8 GT build where mine's more... SEMA? Oh, uh, this is angst. Of course it's angst. How do I say this nicely? Angst looks like a toddler designed it. Meanwhile, Kimmy's is very, very cool. I really like Kimmy's. Bro! Well, boys, we're going on a little bit of a road trip. Let's go try the time trial and then we'll do some online... I'm not gonna ask what happened there, but okay, we'll just, we'll go. Where do they want me to race to? You want me to go all the way over there? And off, no, off road there. Beautiful. This genuinely couldn't go worse. Okay, then go, 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 go. There we go. We're behind Jack now. Go, go, go. Rip it. This is way harder than it looks. Not gonna lie. We are looking good. Okay, nail it right in the middle. Right in the middle. Respawn! Made it. At least I didn't destroy the car. This one is way harder than it looks. No joke. Thread the needle. Beautiful. Threaded. You are kidding me. No! I just wanted to do the time trial. Can we go do a race instead? I'm not built for the time trial, okay? Race number one, no train for me to crash into. I am starting all the way up at the front. I have no idea where we're racing, so uh, bear with me as I learn the circuit. I'm just gonna try and follow the mini map as much as I can. I, You see what I mean? I, <laughs> I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> Don't have confidence on lap one yet. Jack knows where he's going. Jeez, man is flying. All right, well, I've dropped down to P5. We should be okay. Make that P6. I'm able to carry the speed. Make it back to P4. Whoa, look at all the obstacles here. Break, break, break. Big break. A lot of people decided, no, I don't need brake. It's definitely rear wheel drive and gets a really nice amount of slide on through the quarters. I really like it. P7, still anybody's game. Oh, well, his race is over and so is his and nearly mine. That was a good save. The more I drive, the more I'm look. What, 
are we doing? Why did it do that? Snap oversteer to the max. Well, we're in P10. It is now comeback season. This R8 honestly doesn't feel very good for like racing. Like it's a nice race car and it takes corners well, but it doesn't feel balanced. There is P9. Thank you very much. Gain on this guy as well. Send it through there. Beautiful. See, my confidence is coming now. Maybe that wasn't a good time for the confidence. Come on, there we go. There we go. Man snapped it. Make that P8. And again, I nearly followed him. This thing is a death trap. It's an actual death trap. See, he's gone. He's gone. I'm not the only one who's having this problem with this car. I, I really am struggling to drive this thing fast. Ah! All right, let's go to race two because that one's just scat. There's no way Ank picked an off-road racetrack for our second race, right? No. Okay, we're good. As long as my R8 doesn't spin out again on me, I'll count that as a win, I think, honestly. All right, nice start. Already up to P2. Break. Are you kidding me, Ank? This guy literally is making us ruin our cars. Who goes rally racing in supercars? We're actually not looking bad considering that this is a shocking race. I don't, I don't get it. No, he nearly died. He nearly died. You saw that car tried to murder me again. Okay, there we go. Is that lap one done? I think that is lap one done. We lose fifth, but that's okay. Here we go. Nice landing. Nice landing. Nice landings are all the rage. Look at this. Look at this. Gaining, P6, break, P7, considering what we're doing, is not bad. Make it P6. Not gonna lie, this is actually a really fun race. No way. No way. Make it P5. Oh. And race is over. Back to P6. Oh, P8. Never mind. It was just, it was a matter of time. This is actually a really fun race. No. Saved it. Saved it. Rally. Rally vibes. Rally vibes the R8. Again, rally vibes catching all the drifts. Good landing, good landing, good landing. Yes, P6, P5. We're back in it, baby. Five. We're still in it. We're still in P5. No, P6. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Go, 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 go. Down in the ditch. Break. Where are you going? The car <laughs> Nobody break. I forgot what the brake pedal was with two corners to go. B6. What a disaster. Does it really get better than this? A wide body twin turbo Audi R8. Even if it's shocking to drive, it's a lot of fun.